So now we're going to move into the DIY part of our show. This is uh, from High and Mighty. It's the set of two 24 inch floating shelves. Now I know you've seen floating shelves in all those kind of beautiful shelter magazines. Walk us through what we're seeing right here. Oh, it's so amazing. We're literally placing, leveling with the self-adhesive strip, popping in our little teeth, mm -hmm. And, and popping right on our shelf, ready to decorate. This is this lovely woman is Megan Elizabeth. She has a do-it-yourself um, blog that she's been she's been a blogger for 15 years, okay. and um, she does crafts for how many years now? Crafts over 15 years. Over yeah. 15 years. Oh yeah. And then home decor as well. She's bringing us the high and mighty brand. As we mentioned, it's the set of two. So you're looking right here. Set of two floating shelves. What are they made of? The floating shelves. They're uh, they're a carbonate uh, based blend. Okay. So it has a really beautiful wood grain look it and does. a wonderful little beveled edge all the way around. 24 inches wide. It's six inches by two inches. I so love you it. have a nice sized shelf, and you have the option of either your espresso. Yes or your white. Ooh, pretty. So pretty. And they both have that beautiful wood grain and beveled edge. Okay, right off yes. the top, I need you to know the espresso is much more limited at $12.49 on the monthly payment. Think about where you want to have this be. You know, maybe it is, you know, on your stairway as you're going up the stairs, just kind of strategically placed, or on a wall in an office or a kid's room. Mm -hmm. um, tell us how you put these All together right. because are there tools required? There are no tools required. Wow. Everything you need is included. Will you be my assistant? I will. Would you mind holding the little prop okay. wall for me? Holding prop wall. So what I'm going to show you here is this is everything that you need is all included. So you're going to get this little strip that has a level right here in the center. So you don't have to worry about having this be perfect or even on your own. This is all in here for you. So you're going to peel back the tape on the backing. All right. So really simple. Boom, boom. We're going to find where we want to place it on our wall. And I'll just let you from overhead looking double check me to make sure I'm level from the side here. Yeah, you are. Well, it's wow. pretty level here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to press this on. Now these are reusable as well. So if you need to remove them from your wall at any point in time, you're able to do so. So we're just going to place this down on the table just because this is a prop wall. Okay. These are only for drywall, just so you know. Now you're going to have these little teeth. You get a set of two of them. Mm -hmm and they have little arrows on them. So your arrow is pointing up on your level, arrow is pointing up on your teeth. You're just going to place it inside the little grooves of this template that this level is. And you're just going to quickly press it down, wow. boop, boop, into your drywall. And can I show you really quickly yeah. that on the back, mm -hmm. it's not coming through the back of your drywall either. Okay. So it's gripping right in there and you don't need to worry about it pressing through at all. I love it. So it's really simple. So we're going to do the other side real quick. Mm -hmm. Arrows up. Into the little grooves. Into the that little grooves. Shown. And we're just going to get a little start. Yep. Press it down with the palm of your hand. Press. Yep. Press it down the other side. Press. Wow. It's flush. Got now it. we're going to grab our shelf. Once we have our shelf, you can see there's little grooves right on here. We're just going to line that up right along the bottom. Okay? Yep. And that's your, how we're going to do it on the wall. We're going to tilt the shelf up mm -hmm. and pop and lock it into place. So now what we're able to do wow. is lift and decorate. So okay. it's as simple as peel, place, pop, press, decorate. That's um, it. Wow. And they're level. And they're level. And they hold 20 pounds. Oh my heavens. And they hold 20 pounds. They hold 20 yes. pounds. So let's take a little look okay. back here. Yes, totally. Let's do this. Yes. Oh my God. And they're removable. So we're just okay. gonna go ahead and take another look. I already have one placed on the wall just to make sure we had it level ahead of time. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna grab my teeth again. They're upward. Mm -hmm. Just gonna find the template, press, pop it in. Press, pop it in. Side one. Side two. I'll hold this because it's press, a mock wall. Pop it in, press. Pop it in. Got it. We're done. We're going to line up the nope. bottoms of our teeth. Yep. Lift. And slide down. Pop down. And we are ready to start decorating the kitchen. Have a little on-the-go coffee station. Ready to decorate the bathroom for a little luxury spa station or a place to put the curling Shoot. iron. You want to take them off? It's just as easy as the same. Lift up. Pull it down. Pop off. A little uh, flathead screwdriver or even a putty knife is all you need to pop these out. And look at this, Rachel. I will show Let you me, really quick. Can I ask you a question with that? If you're not strong enough to push this in, can mm -hmm. you use a hammer? Or? You could use a hammer. Okay. It's, it's pretty. It's a pretty easy push, I will okay. tell you. It takes a little, like the palm of your hand sometimes, yep. more than okay. just your thumb. But really, if you just grab a putty knife or a flathead screwdriver, it pops right out. And if you can see this, yeah. Come on tiny... Yep. 
little dimple pinholes. Okay. You're not leaving massive holes or anchors or anything in your wall with floating shelves. Okay, so what you need to know is, like, what does this require for me to use this? What do I need to have? Everything that's in the kit, that's it. Okay, but what kind of wall? Oh, drywall. I, I apologize. You can only, only have using dry, drywall. drywall. Mm -hmm. So know that wherever you want to put this, I just want to be clear. Yes. It's not going to go in cement. It's not going to go in stucco. This isn't going in stucco. Mm -mm. It's not going in... Um, you know, kind of like uh, brick walls. Or wood right? paneling. Or wood paneling. This right. is going to go in. Your drywall, yes. Drywall. And most homes That's where it built goes. after the 1960s have drywall Great. somewhere in the home, mm -hmm. but just be sure that you're using it on drywall and then you're ready to go. So when you want to remove the shelves, yeah. all you're going to do is pop them out. This comes off. You can restick it back up on the wall and you're good to start decorating again. Just line up the shelves right there along the bottom. Let's see what's that here. This side. <coughs> and we're going to go up and pop it in. And then Rachel's gonna decorate for us. Um, yeah. <laughs> Look at this. Is there an A somewhere or Joy? Joy. Oh, there we go. And we're good to Yay. go. Yay! Look how easy it Isn't is. Isn't that easy? Yes. I mean, I love what you're doing here. So, what do we have here with the hooks that are coming up? So, these are the hooks That's coming up. That's super cute. But check also it by out. High and Mighty. Yes. I mean, so you're choosing your espresso or your mm -hmm. white. A lot of you are actually getting more than one set. Right. Remember, you actually get two shelves per set. Yes. This is a $25 shelf. This is a $25 shelf. It is not hiring a contractor or hiring a handyman and feeling like um, I'm going to have have to have a professional do it. Right. You've instantly become a professional. Yes. You are hanging up that leveling strip that lives right inside there. You're pressing in each side of those pins, lining up the bottom of the shelf and popping it in place. You're ready to do 20 pounds of decorating from your favorite decor, your favorite little knickknacks and antiques. It does not matter your style you are able to find something that works for your home in the matter of moments without doing crazy damage. So if you're renting, guess what? You can fill in these tiny little holes with just something as simple as toothpaste. You don't have to have massive holes and anchors anywhere. So I just want to let you know that we've got two choices, the white and the espresso mm -hmm. and the white. If you come down here, the white has been more popular. So if you're looking yeah. at the white, please don't wait on that. Um, a lot of you are actually picking up more than one set. I think it would be perfect for dorm rooms. Oh, Oftentimes yes. dorm rooms have drywall, mm -hmm. right? So you're only for drywall. So I just want to set expectations only for drywall. Yes. You can press these in by hand yep. if you need to. You can use a little bit, what, you can use a little side of a hammer? Or yeah, you could you just use a little mallet or something. You don't want to hammer in You're like You're not hammering hard. it in because no. you need to have these hooks yes. for the shelf to hold on. And then the shelves Correct. hold, want to attach it. How much do the shelves hold? Hold 20 pounds. So you're just going to line it up, press it down, and pop it into place. And you have a perfectly level floating shelf for any room that has drywall in your house. I love it. And mm -hmm. I, you are going to stay with me, Megan Elizabeth. Yeah. I do want to give you a reminder. This is our best value of the day on QVC2. It's